today we'll discuss a numerical which is related to the PMMC instrument that is permanent magnet moving coil instrument the numerical is the coil of a PMMC voltmeter is 40 millimeter long and 30 millimeter wide and has 100 turns on it. The control spring exerts a torque that is the control torque of 120 into 10 to the power minus 6 Newton meter. This is given Newton meter the unit. Now when the deflection is 100 divisions on full scale full stop if the flux density of magnetic field in air gap is 0.5 over per meter square then estimate the resistance that must be put in series with the coil of the PMMC instrument to give 1 volt per division the resistance of voltmeter coil may be neglected that means you can neglect the resistance of the voltmeter coil now if we go for a solution of this numerical then it is like that we know that the deflecting torque at full scale deflection is this td is the deflecting torque td is equals to n b i l r this is the formula of the deflecting torque according to the given parameters we have to replace this n b i l r we can't replace i here because i is uh, unknown at this stage so you can replace the value of n l b and r so it will be like that 66 into 10 to the power minus 3 into i newton meter now the controlling torque is also given in the numerical so this is the controlling torque in newton meter tc it is denoted by t suffix c now you know that under steady state condition tc and td that is the control and deflecting torque are equal to each other so by equating these two torques we get the value of i which is 2 milliampere so the full scale deflection current is this 2 milliampere value now let the resistance r be put in series the resistance which will put in series with the voltmeter coil to provide one volt per division to achieve our target hence uh, voltage across the voltmeter is we know that as per ohm's law i into r so it is 2 into 10 to the minus 3 the voltage that is the value of the current into r here r is unknown the resistance which is in series now volts per division is equals to full scale deflection divided by full scale deflection in divisions this is the basic formula of volts per divisions and if we put the appropriate values in this equation then we get 2 into 10 to the power minus 3 into r this is the full scale deflection divided by the full scale deflection in division that is 100 so if we do this then we obtain the volts per division and this in terms of capital R this value should be equal to 1 in order to have 1 volt per division as per the desired condition so if we equate this to 1 then we can easily find out the value of capital R that is the resistance which is to be connected in series with the voltmeter and the value of the R is 50,000 ohm or 50 kilo ohm so this is the numerical the answer of the numerical